hello viewers thanks for joining me welcome to onyx food hill in today's video we are going to make a very simple recipe with potato so i'm going to be calling this recipe curried potato porridge it's just a simple porridge made with potato i'm going to be using irish potato so some ingredients for making curried potato porridge include i have here boiled chicken you can use turkey or fish for this recipe i have some colorful vegetables here in the tray i have here green peas chili peppers green bell peppers red bell peppers chopped carrots ground crayfish chopped onions turmeric powder curry powder and some potato so i'm using both the white and the yellow irish potato just because the white wasn't enough so i had to mix it with the yellow so because i've made it very easy for us by chopping all our vegetables so we are just going to go straight forward to prepare this food right away i cut the chicken into tiny pieces so you can just cut it the way you want and because i don't like my potato to be chunky i have to reduce them into medium sizes if you haven't cooked your meat you can do so right away to boil this chicken i'm going to put a link below the description box so you can check it out it might be helpful in the chicken brought into a pot then place it on heat so when the meat broth starts to boil bring the raw potato into it and gently drop them into the broth then cover the lid and bring it to a boil before the potato starts to boil add in some chopped onions Two tablespoons of crayfish, a little salt, and one seasoning cube. You may not need to add the seasoning cube if your chicken broth is very spicy. So after adding all the ingredients, gently stir the porridge to combine. Adding a teaspoon of turmeric powder to the potato and also a teaspoon of curry powder. After adding in stir and allow all the ingredients to combine. So you have to check the potato to know if it's cooked. So if it's not properly cooked, just cover it and allow it to cook properly. While you are still cooking the potato, if you have another heat sauce, just heat up vegetable oil about five tablespoons in a pan just add a little onion to it with garlic add in some chili peppers i use much so you can reduce the quantity and some green bell peppers and also the red bell peppers chopped carrots finally adding the green peas after adding in stir allow the vegetable to cook on a very low heat bring in the chicken and add also let this cook in the oil for another 10 minutes so come back to the potato stir and test to see if it's soft once your potato is soft and it's still looking watery you just dissolve about two tablespoons of plain flour and add to it then i like to boil for five minutes it will become thick Season the vegetable with a little salt and allow it to cook for another 5 minutes.
go back to the vegetables open it and stir once it's properly cooked put off heat then transfer it to the potato and stir gently adding the vegetable into the porridge Gently stir to combine and let this cook for another 3 minutes then put off it and serve your curried potato. You can now serve your curried potato porridge. This is very creamy, lovely, colorful. This was my curried potato porridge with chicken. And I hope you loved this video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to this channel. Like this video, comment, and share this video. Bye.